What is up everybody? Welcome back to the Comic Sand channel. We have a pretty exciting video today. We are over here in Daytona at Arkham Asylum Comics and they are having their grand opening today. If you haven't seen one of our $100 challenges before, how it's gonna work is me and Angela are gonna split the $100 so we'll both have $50 to spend on comics or whatever else in the shop that we would like and the $100 is before tax. So don't get tricky people. I know you're gonna be like, it was 105. And it looks like they have a food truck, some cannolis, and that kind of looks like a little Build-A-Bear thing. So really excited to check everything out. Let's see if we can go inside. Mark, I'm the owner, one of the owners. Oh, Hi, Angelo, here. nice, nice to, meet to meet you. It's been so busy that we didn't even have time to do the grand opening, so I figured, I mean, we have to, you know yeah. what I mean? Nobody really knows we're here, so. If you spend $25, $25 you get a raffle ticket, okay. and you get to pick oh, a number off oh, the wall yep. to get that one. Yeah. The chance to get a $60 book up here, we got. Oh, there's we got like four, a little. We got four higher price books up there. Oh. Let's see what you got, pick 19. Thank you. Oh, lenticular oh, cover. That's a simile, that's a ticket of comics, 27. Yeah, that's not that's not a real yeah, like, that seems for two hundred bucks and nine six. <laughs> I was like, what a steal! These are probably more your your choices, but pop into the first box I saw, kind of see what they got. Original art sketch covers. In this box. Oh, that's cool, Goofy. Oh, these are interesting. Some like Disney sketch covers, some signatures. That's a really cool, Lady Death. Oh, that's Beautiful. sick. That's cool. Got a lot of original art in here. The Walking Dead. Oh, that's awesome. It's like painted. Really cool Spider Gwen. Oh, there's an Adam Hughes. I wonder where they found all these. Stegman for 200. Probably came out of someone's personal collection. Yeah. Someone that was into original art. These are crazy. I'm seeing if I can find a, a $50 one around here. Yeah, these are nice detective comics. Solid shapes on a lot of these too. Grab that. What was that? That's a. How much is this? Oh, <laughs> hundred and fifty bucks. But this right here is an awesome book. First Talia Al Ghul, one thirty for four dollars. See now we're starting to get into the price range. One thirty-five for three. At three bucks, as long as they're in solid shape, I would definitely say pick them up. I know, I didn't even think about getting a, uh, an art piece done. If you so want, maybe. let's go over there and okay. see if before it gets too busy, because yeah. it might get super busy and then you got to wait a little bit. So. Okay, let's go see what's going on with that. I don't have any cool. blanks. Three dollars. These are three dollar books. Maybe we'll just grab all the like a bunch of those, yeah. daredevils he has that are under five bucks as long as they look like they're in solid shape. I mean, they're definitely not super high grade copies, but um, for three dollars, I don't think. Yeah, can't go wrong. Yeah. Oh, this is a great one too. Black Widow. 155 for three dollars. Come on, look at that cover and Captain America. These are all free for 20 okay. per day, only. Uh, <laughs> and then the comics, my comics are like mostly 15. The ones that are on the side. How much are you doing like a headshot? Uh, well, if it's quick, it's free. Uh, if it's like involved, it's like it's like 30. Okay, got it. Books 10 and then the sketch, sketch is 30. 30. That puts me at 40 and then I still got 10 bucks. And 10% off. Is 10% off everything? everything? Oh, everything. Everything's 10% off. Except okay. the sketches. <laughs> you have to work Need your money. Do you know what you're going to get? Yeah, I'm going to get Vampirella. What else do you get on a Vampirella book? Angela? Mine's going to be cooler than yours, by the way. My $50 versus your $50. Because I'm going to have original art. Oh, maybe. I would like Sketch an original off. art piece. I don't know. I, I got to try to see what else they have. But yeah. I mean, $30 is a very good deal. Definitely one thing you got to do when you get to a con for any event with an artist, oh, yeah. just get, get your stuff done first. Yeah. It's one of those things that just destroys you, man. Like, shows are tough. But, like, it's quick money, but, like, I see I see doing this stuff as more important to me. I would make more just doing shows solidly, but, like, this means more to me. Takes away from the art. Yes, yeah. Because, like, you're just, you're you're selling, you're, you're constantly go, go, go. The, the, the travel is really tough and so it's nice to just sit at home and work on art i mean that that was the goal all along so. 11 years ago he actually made that for her and signed it i couldn't make it i'm 
stuck at work. What are you guys gonna pick off the wall? Uh, she is looking for, I get, what is it, Raven? Rogue. Rogue? Rogue? I, look, I'm not into this. Though. Yeah, Rogue is right there. I really want to get an original piece done, yeah. but that'll be my 50 we bucks. Think we can break choices, the $50 choices. rule? No, we can never break the $50 it's rule. It's a grand it's a opening, challenge. though. We need to break it, maybe. It's a challenge. But even if you get the the book and the sketch, it's still, you still have 10 bucks left. If I did get one done, I'd probably go with the Poison Ivy and Harley for 10 bucks and then the $30 sketch. What do you guys think? I think we should do it. Drop the ball again. Didn't even think about bringing our sketchbook, which we have. We're not very good collectors, guys. This is your sketchbook? Yeah. Oh, wow. that's awesome. I do all Gotham. Oh, you're out? Yeah. Oh, wow. Derek Chu. Carly? Yeah. 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 Card journal. Those are beautiful. Okay. Wow, those are so uh, nice. How long have you had the sketchbook for? Three years. Oh, wow. Yeah. How much do you usually pay for like a sketch like this? You know, these nice ones. Some, I mean, they start from like a hundred to like three hundred bucks. Wow, this is a great sketch for your DC fan. Yeah. Oh, I love that. It's gonna be sick. I'm really excited. We'll give you guys a little before, before shot, and and then we'll have to re redo that and be like after. Yeah. Vampire on this one. Can you do Harley Quinn and Poison on this one? Uh, that no. be? Not today. Okay. Poison Ivy because I have <laughs> Usually the uh, usually people pick Ivy. Yeah. There's just a lot of Harley, you know. She at work. <laughs> yeah. She's at work and she really, really did her best to try getting off to come to see you, but they wouldn't give her off, so she sent me and her daughter to come down there. <laughs> I always wondered how that works. How like when an artist goes somewhere, if you well, get like, paid before you show like up, or I'm local. Comic book shops don't make a ton of money usually. Yeah. It's a tough business. Like so, I'm just trying to help. I don't do artist alley because I don't want all the drama. There's a lot of drama in artist alley. I'm telling you. Like, and egos. Oh my god. I hope I never get to that point where like I think I'm like a gift to the world or something like that. Because some of those guys, man, it's just like they think they are you know, like you're 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 honored to be in their presence yeah. kind of thing. And I'm like, oh god. How much for that uh, Scarlet witch right next to you? Scarlet. Oh, this is a Gicle, it's a different type of print. This one is 60. Look at the blacks and stuff on this, like they reflect light. The blacks on this never reflect any light. It always like sucks it in. So like the blacks are always like a black hole. We're here as representing this one of your biggest fans. Oh Congrats cool. Oh my god, so that long was ago. Mine. 11, really? 11 yeah. years ago. Oh wow. That's that one. That's like one of my first shows ever. Hello. Sarah's happy. I'm a happy camper now. These are I'm gonna let this one dry a little. It's not thick. I love all the detail. The moon and the blood's popping out. Comment down below and let us know which one you like more though. Harley Quinn Poison Ivy? Or the Vampirella. So we still have $10 because we got the $10 book, which was 20 and then that was 60 so that's 80 So technically, we both still have $10 in the $100 challenge. That's a nice one. How much is that one? Jordan? Yeah. Oh. Solid copy. Six bucks. Oh, there you go. Ooh, First Carnage. That? 50 bucks? Oh, that's a good deal. It's a low grade copy. First print. Here's the second print, ASM1. So key. Ooh, five bucks. Fifty-five dollars signed by John Boy Myers. Eighty-five dollars. That's, That's sick, cool, though. Yeah. One hundred twenty bucks signed That's with sick. the COA, that. and it's got a really cool COA too. It is. Yeah, I like how it fits perfectly in the comic. The Sentinel Strike. It's actually a really cool book. Uh, One hundred four with Scarlet Witch. It's Twelve bucks. Four. Ooh, beast on 136. Oh, cool. oh, he's got the oh, set. Wow. Yeah, all of them. Is that the whole one through? I think it's one through seven. nine, right? Is it, is it nine? Because it ends at seven there. I think it's nine is the complete run. What's it's almost nine. Yeah. Saw, uh, You're slacking. There's only seven. Know, right? These are great. Batman 423 for 40 bucks. And it looks like they got the variant here, the foil oh, variant. Yeah, Megacon. 125. We got the Mignola covers. I actually need the Joker cover. Do they have that? Oh, they do. Oh, $5? Oh, snap. What's wrong with it for five bucks? I don't know. 
I don't know if anybody remembers this show. So these are some fun Harley covers. A little bit pricier. There was a full moon in that one to the left of you too. Eight dollars. Jusco cover. Oh my god. Right in the front of the cool. Oh here you go. Nostalgia. Forty-five bucks. Black hat. Oh, these were the ones he had in the cover. cases. Yeah. Yeah, they got a lot of great Wonder Woman issues. 40 bucks. Yeah, they range anywhere from like 20 to 40. 12 centers. Probably pick up a, probably a $10 Wonder Woman in here. Maybe in the other side. 25 bucks? Ooh, that's a nice copy. Wonder Woman. Oh, man. oh, that's a cool one. Oh, oh I have that one. one. Yeah. Oh, that one's cool too. Huh? Twenty bucks. Oh, snap. Oh, these are like five dollars. Hmm. Okay, let me let me look at them. Oh, the one. flash. Five bucks. Comment down below who got the better grabs for ten bucks. That Sarah got the Wonder Woman. Yeah, I told them. These are nice Wonder Womans though. They are really nice. She got the original art. He's still got a full line of people. So it's been pretty awesome to add that to the collection. You guys have to comment down below and let us know what you think of this comic shop. Should we get a Pokemon pack and see if we can get something good? Which one do you grab? I don't know. Astral Radiance one. Astral Radiance? Yeah. That one, Rebel Clash? Yes. For two fifty. All right, I'll tell you what. We'll get a Rebel Clash for two fifty, and then let's get a Silver Tempest. So I'm going with twenty five. Which one are you going with? Oh well, I thought um, I'm gonna do twenty. He's saying thirty seven. No, twenty seven. Twenty seven. Okay, okay, I'll go twenty seven. Twenty seven. And twenty five. Twenty five and twenty seven. See what we got. All right, we'll see. Where's 27? Mine, 27. 27. Okay, let's see what I get. Oh, that's ready? Swamp thing. Superman. I'm John Boy over here. When is that gonna be? We haven't set a date yet, but he's already agreed to come down, so we're gonna get him down here. We're gonna try and get four, about four big name artists a year to come do signings and stuff. You said to grab this one, right? So here, you open that one. <laughs> see what we get. Father train them all. Don't destroy anything. That one's cool. I'll pick the Astral Radiance because I like that one. That one's got some cool stuff. Yeah, I got your back. We got the Teddy or something. Man, man, pie. <laughs> I'm gonna butcher all these names. Okay. This one's got a lot in it. There you go. And then, and then a lot of cards in their pack. This one has a lot. Oh, cool trainer card. Oh, yeah. Gotta give it the good luck. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Let's see what we got. So I don't know a card trick. There's probably a card trick to it. One, two, three, four from the back, I think. Four from the back. Wrong. So you got red energy, stone yeah, germ. Oh, is it three? Leafy, Drowsy, Spinarak, Ralts, Krogunk, Professor, and the Neuburn. So yeah, I was one. This was the rare, I think. We use apples to get the yeast. Do it Neplatana style. If they do it in Naples, Italy. How long have you been making pizza for? Since I was about 15 and I'm 27. Oh, me too. 27? <laughs> yeah. 27, probably. Mostly in a good way. Yeah, right. <laughs> San Marzano tomatoes. Some grated Parmesan. Fresh basil. Fiori latte. Just fresh mozzarella, but even better. And that's how they do it. They make it on the table, and they slide it onto the peel. Into the oven. That's about 1,000 degrees in there. Very wonderful pizza. Nostra pizza napolitana. One bite, here I go. Okay. Maybe I should be the first scared. bite. Maybe you should take the All right, Angelo's gonna take the first bite. Oh, the crust. Good sauce, good cheese, and the crust. Oh, yeah. Appreciate it. Thank you so Thank much. You so much. Thank you. We have chocolate chips. All right. Mama cannoli. Look at those. <laughs> Oh, Alright, got my pizza, my cannolis, I'm ready to go now. <laughs>